eighth day futuristic robo porn. <laughs> <laughs> fucking in the future. Go go gadget labia. I don't. <laughs> I don't know who that's for, or why you would watch it. I don't know. Um, the next one was a, a parody film called The Sex Files. So it's the X Files, but they have they have sex. But to me, the X Files is already dirty because there's an X there. Because X rated means it's probably a cum shot. Like that's what I mean. And so it's like. The sex, you already have a, I don't know, it's already dirty. The next film was award-winning Clips X Biz. So they took like the best clips of porn from the year, the award-winning porn. I don't know if porn awards count like an Academy Award. The award-winning anal reaming, I don't know. The next film was uh, French Squirters. I don't know why they have to be French. I'm thinking, like, if you're into squirt, I'm sorry you guys are eating, but like, if you're into squirting, I can't see you going, oh, squirting, great, great. oh, French, oh, uh, like, why did put the nationality? The next one was called Focus, and it was a murder mystery guy on guy gay porn, but it was a murder mystery. I don't, do you really need that much plot for porn? Like, Focus. Because it sounds like an art film. It sounds like, you know, M. Night would have directed it before the, before the airbender. Um, second one, I'm sorry, the next one was uh, Sensuous Lesbians. And then the tagline was graphic but peaceful. <laughs> Thank God. Thank God, you know, because I, I like graphic, but somebody could say please once in a while. <laughs> And I don't know how you can be graphic and tasteful. Isn't the point of graphic that it isn't tasteful? That should negate the fuck it. Next one, <laughs> Amer amateur swing party as opposed to professional swing parties, I guess. Swings creep me out. Um, I accept the fact that some people get married and can't stay true. But to me, when you're a swinger, you're just you're bragging about it too much. You're too. You're, you're too in touch with your own id when you're like, well, we're swingers. You're fucking creepy. Next, bi bi sex three-way freeway. And then the tagline, two, two dudes, a dudette, and burning rubbers. <laughs> what the fuck does that even mean? They're fucking so hard that the condom kept, like, Burning, like, are they fucking in a car? Are they, are they fucking in a plane? What? Two dudes, a dudette, and burning rubbers. Wrong. I don't want to see that. Uh, the next film, I couldn't make. I, if I wanted to make this up, I couldn't. Extra filthy, wall to wall, nonstop action. As opposed to carefully plotted action, I, better orgasms for women instructional. Women can have orgasms now? <laughs> next they'll want to vote! Um, no, the next one is, uh, <laughs> this was my favorite title of them all. Um, three Europeans and one guy. What I like about that title is it implies that you can't be from Europe and a male. <laughs> Just being from Europe makes you a woman. Three Europeans and a guy. There's guys in Europe, there's lots of them. Next title, Wife Switch 2010. Then screw my wife while I watch. <laughs> <laughs> kind of demanding. I don't, I don't know who that's for either. Documentary. <laughs> Every time it's a Michael Moore looking guy. Glasses and a cap. Yeah, get her. He's eating a bag of chips. <laughs> fucking, fuck your own wife, you son of a bitch. <laughs> I did not train at porn school for eight years to just fuck your wife. <laughs> fuck your own wife, you lazy slacker twat. 
Uh, the next one, Cox in Paradise. And the tagline, I swear to you, said, Super gay. <laughs> How much gayer can you get than a guy blowing another... What's gayer? Like, are they on a fucking unicorn while they're doing it? Super gay. <laughs> Is that little Richard fucking Richard Simmons? <laughs> How much gayer can you get than just gay sex? <laughs> this was another title that, uh... That's super gay. <laughs> Foaming. Um... Next title was another one that confused me. Pushing 40, older women, 2010. Now that's a guy having sex with women whose age is pushing 40. It's not one guy shoving 40 women around the field. <laughs> next one was my wife's hot friends. And then the next one was called twinks. I'm not up to date on gay terminology but I have friends who are gay, so I asked a friend, I said, what's a twink? And he was like, oh, he was all happy? So I was like, Ugh. And he said, according to him, a twink is, is a gay guy who's younger looking without facial hair. That's a twink. So now you, now you know. And knowing's half of the valley. Um, the next title, XXL Super Dicks. Which, giant cocks <laughs> like the knight's tail they're just running at each other <laughs> I don't even think there's a woman in the shy <laughs> pole vaulting <laughs> playing pool <laughs> with their giant dicks the next one was called Jenna Jameson best of package and I felt bad because I guess that's for guys that haven't jerked off since the mid-90s when she was still on top of her game. Like, the guy just got out of a coma and like, I want someone to jerk Oh, Jenna Jameson, best of. Great, I don't have to watch new porn. The next one, it's a title I didn't like. And uh, again, it's just the wording. <laughs> like, what? Um, it was homemade Japanese. And then I watched the trailer for it, and I, okay, okay, it's, it's, it's homemade movies of Japanese people having sex, but I thought it was a guy, like, making Japanese people, like, in his tub, like, gluing arms to go, I made a Japanese! Um, the next one was called Older Mamas, and uh, the one after that was The Big Bang Theory, which was a parody of the TV show. If you've ever seen it, a bunch of nerdy guys, they, they're like physicists and they live in an apartment and there's this hot blonde who works at the cheesecake place or something. And then they want to hurt, but they can't, and then they do, and then the show loses something. And But they didn't even change the title. And I think that's lazy, because it's porn. You can make it funny, like Schindler's Fist. And, you know, like you can make Edward Dick Hands, and you know, like, to just use Big Bang Theory, that's lazy writing. Next one was Massive Cox. So, more pole vaulting. Uh, the next movie was Nature's Breasts. Um, real boobs are, are, you know, like, you know, raisins are nature's candy. And, and uh, natural boobs are something better than candy. The, the one after that was Real Floppy Tits. That's the title of the movie. Like... <laughs> Okay, we rented all this equipment, we got, what are we going to call this one? Real floppy tits. I would love to hear that read at the Academy Awards. And for best sound, real floppy tits. I would just love to hear that. Next one was squirting Japanese. <laughs> I'm squirting Japanese, I really think so. And then, at that point, I stopped watching the preview channel, because I was nauseous from watching that much. Foreign preview. 